talking folks. Dr. Freedom here with the Times from Dr. News. News from in and around the universe that's going to hit you so quick, so fast, you'll swear that a transgalactic mosquito just whizzed by your ear, making you go, ooh, I hate that noise. Um, yeah, just some weird, just a few tiny things. We do know Bradders has been going places because he's been doing his Bradders bangers thing on you know Instagram as usual. We're going to talk about that in a minute. Um, other than that, um, we're not sure where they're going to film unless they're filming in studio all the time now. Like I said, the trap door on Doctor Who News is pretty much locked shut at this point. So until they do some more location filming somewhere, you know, like I said, no one knows anything. And I, it's just weird how you got so much speculation running around out there. Channels going, this is confirmed, that is confirmed. We have nothing confirmed, really. You know, especially as far as returning villains and all that. So let's go to a little bit I do have for you really quick, okay? First up, this just popped up on the BBC America Twitter page just about an hour or so ago. Uh, what you call it? Uh, send us your message to help welcome Jody, blah, blah, blah. Here are the details. You can send a welcome video to the new Dr. Jody Whitaker. Send your full name, username, and your video message to social at bbcamerica.com. For full details, go to this link right here. So I'll be bouncing this to you right here, and I'll, I'll even put this details link here, I think, below it. That way, you just, you know, if you want, you just go straight there and bypass the tweet if you want. So I just a nice little way of saying welcome to the neighborhood, so to speak. All right. All right, moving up. Now, this is the one that's really hitting the news like crazy. Dr. Marathon of 500 plus classic episodes to stream on Twitch. That is right, ladies and gentlemen. Twitch is back with another TV marathon, a streaming stunt. More than 500 classic Doctor Who episodes will be broadcast on the Amazon Amazon owned service over a seven week span. The Doctor episodes from 26 seasons, going back from the show's inception in 63 until 89, will be available on Twitch starting May 29th at 11 a.m. Pacific time. Fans can tune in each weekday to watch a collection of live streaming episodes on twitch.tv slash twitchpresents in six to seven hour daily blocks, which will be repeated twice back to back for international audiences. The older episodes of the sci-fi cult favorite, which presumably will appeal to a sizable portion of a Twitch gamer-focused core audience of 15 million daily active users are coming to Twitch under a pact with BBC Studios. Now note they're, that they're separate from the modern iteration of BBC's Doctor Who with Season 11 to feature Jodie Whittaker. Ah. Uh, what? Um, no, they're not separate. The new series that started in 2005 is known as a continuation of the series. They are not separate. I don't know well, who's got – oh, God, the crack pipe must be getting passed around again. Uh, now, for the Dr. Marathon Twitch viewers who subscribe to the Twitch Presents channel for $4.99 per month, will have access to 14 blah, 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 blah. 14 exclusive emotes – or uh, I'm, I'm assuming emoticons – themed after each of the first seven doctors. In addition to Twitch, we'll host a giveaway for Doctor Who fans in the U.S., U.K., and Canada each week of the event, including a grand prize trip to the fall 2018 MCM London Comic Con. Info on the sweepstakes are, is available at this link right here. So boom, 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 ha, 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 ha. So be sure to go check that out. I think that's amazing, but I just can't believe they just said that, that they're separate from the new series? No, they're not. Okay, now this popped up over on the Doctor Who Production News blog spot. The 13 Doctors on the cover of the Bug Report publication released in conjunction with the Licensing Expo, which is taking place, I believe, over in Las Vegas, if memory serves. Now, unfortunately, the publication does not impart any new information about Series 11, of course. There you go. So, just some nifty, nifty stuff going on there. Now, this is what they've been able to find so far for Dr. Merchandise at the Licensing Expo, and I hope they have more news soon. Now, there's a new line with an attractive coat, a handbag, and some jewelry featuring Gallifrey and symbols, and most importantly, stars. I hope there'd be stars. And this 
is like a steampunk deal going on here. More, at least that's what it seems like to me more than Doctor Who, you know, because you have the cogs, the gears. But okay, that's that's Gallifreyan over here on this side. All right, I see what they're going at. So, and there's a pretty little handbag. Now, the star, do the stars look familiar? They should. They are the stars on the 13th Doctor's earring, and they've captured some Twitter moments here. I believe this pic will take you to the pic, the blow, blown up pic of her ear, which shows you the earrings that, you know, the earring that she's wearing that seems to focus on a group of stars. So wham, 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 here you go. That was taking place. But like I said, they've released nothing majorly new that we know of other than some merchandise. Big whoop. Once again, Bradders bangers. I'll leave both of these for you. These were up over the last couple of days. And like I said, they're just hilarious as hell. But it does prove he's going to work. And he's going to work in the morning time. But where is he going? And on the last bit, this is the newest look at the packaging for the Season 12 Doctor Who Tom Baker set. That's going to be coming out this June. Now, that, of course, remember, that's been pushed back to June 18th. So I have mine on pre-order, and I am eagerly awaiting it in my house. I really am. Because it's going to be so amazing to see what's all been added, to see how they pulled off you know, the Blu-ray quality and all that on these. Oh, boy. I want to touch myself in funny places. Okay, so really nifty stuff going on there. All right, that didn't sound good, did it? All right, so once again, um, not much going on on the filming front right now. I think what it is, it seems to me like they're filming a lot of the stuff that's supposed to be getting filmed in the studio now. So until we get a lot now there was people running around going, there's a lot of filming going on on Cardiff Harbor or whatever, in Cardiff Bay. That turned out to be for the, uh, Jerusalem, which I believe is a miniseries or something coming out soon. So that had nothing to do with Doctor Who. But once again, if I hear anything, if I get any little nodules of information that I can tell to you is true, I'll pass it on to you. But until then, everybody take care. Enjoy the rest of your day. Look at that. I'm balder than usual. Good night, folks.